Oh, it's happening! It's happening! Oh my god, Jeffrey's dying! Oh my god, yes! Hey guys, this is the third episode of the Occult Baby Challenge. So, I have decided that this episode, seeing as though it's Halloween, I wanted to celebrate the Halloween season by doing something, um, a, a bit spooky. So, I, I've looked at our, our friends, right? And I just see a lot of enemies of ours. And you know what I wanted to do? I wanted to stop having enemies. So, you know, you could make friends with your enemies or you could kill them. See, different method, same outcome. And I have decided that I wanted to do a Halloween dinner party where I might cook something a bit deadly and kill all of my enemies. <laughs> so that is exactly what we're going to do. But right now we have a daughter that has a stinky ass diaper and we're kind of starving. But the other problem is, is that this little house is not suitable for a dinner party. One, we just have a mini fridge. So we can't exactly cook a deadly meal or even eat it unless everybody's going to be eating on my bed, which I don't know about you guys, but I don't like crumbs in my bed. So we need to make enough money to expand this place, get a proper kitchen and dining area, and we need to learn the recipe for puffer fish nigiri. So I need to go to every vendor in San Mai Shuna basically to find it, because I don't remember where it is. And I could have researched it, but I'm lazy. So that is where we're at. So I am... I have decided that Halloween is going to be tomorrow. So today, it's already 2.40 p.m., so... We've already lost a lot of time. But today, I need to make enough money to expand this house and learn the recipe. And as you can see, she has zero cooking skills. She has a lot of other skills, but zero cooking. Meaning that I am pretty suitable for making a horrible meal that is likely to kill. So let's... I think we need to get started. Today, it's money-making time. Money-making time... And recipe learning time. So, I don't really even know where to begin. It's... We don't really have much. We could knit. I don't really think that's very suitable. Or we could paint. Now, that seems better. And... Yeah, I don't really know how else I would make money. I mean, we have these uh, autographs, but... They're not really worth anything right now. <laughs> But one day we'll make them worth something. But right now, we need, I think, to just get painting. And then I think we'll sell the paintings. But not out of our inventory. But we'll try to mark up the value. So much that people will just give me all their money. And our child is annoying me. I've had this child for a day and it's already annoying. <laughs> Freaking child. I'm wondering if I should age her up soon. I don't know. But right now, we just need to start painting. Okay. So Halloween has been created. I don't even know why Halloween isn't already an event in-game. I mean, they have everything for Halloween. They already have trick-or-treating, wearing costumes and stuff. So I don't really know why. But it doesn't matter. Because we have created it. Now all we need to do is just make that money. Now, I also wanted... Oh my god, Caleb, leave me alone. But I also wanted to do something else. And that something else is have another child or at least get pregnant. So, I have... When I think about Halloween, I think witches. Because personally, I always dress as a witch for Halloween. So, we are going to try to get ourselves a witch baby or a warlock baby. Either one. But that's what we're going to do. Because it's it's the Halloween spirit, right? That is horrible. What the heck is that? Ew. Disgusting. 
put that in your inventory. Oh my god, this child won't stop crying! Ugh, every chance it gets. Oh my gosh, why are you still crying? <sighs> I just want to welcome you to the community, and my, what a lovely neck you have there. Thank you? I think? Ugh, gosh. Driving me insane. Oh, he's here. Um. Hi. Um. We're just gonna ignore him. It's almost Bella's birthday. Yay. Okay. Okay, it's four in the morning. So just grab a snack and then go to sleep. <laughs> and then tomorrow we're gonna sell paintings. Try to find the recipe. Oh my gosh! Try to find the recipe and then have our dinner party. Because we spent the day uh, getting many paintings. It's Halloween. Great. Yes. Ugh, voting. Gross. No thanks. We're gonna harvest all of these and then. Carmen Frost has a nice ring to it. What do you think, Carmen? Would you like to try. <laughs> things out and see where it goes um i i would actually oh my gosh <laughs> well we do have to have a baby with him at some point in ten table and markup prices 300 <laughs> percent and start a yard sale i i, I think i should have locked the house <laughs> People aren't actually buying stuff. I have less money than I did before. Come on, people. And I'm locking this door. Lock door for everyone but household members. Press pass. Hey! Hey! How, how did you get in there? Hey, hey, champ. So get this. I have a cool business idea. This is going to be the big one. But I, uh, I just need a few more Somalians to get it off the ground. Like a thousand Somalians. Do you think you could help a buddy out? You'll get it all back. And then some, I swear. Well, I've never met you, Bess. So... We're not really buddies. And I am trying to do an amazing dinner party, so I can't really afford that right now. Ugh. But how else are my dreams supposed to come true? Thanks anyway, I guess. Well, it's not really my responsibility to make your dreams come true. No, is it? No, it is not. Come on, one more painting, people. One more. Come on. Oh my gosh. What is happening? There is a freaking fight. Hey, kid. Oh, you're a trick-or-treater? Ugh. Buy it. Thank you. Did you pay me money? You just... What, what happened to my painting? She swiped it. What? You swiped it and didn't pay for my painting? Well, guess what, lady? You're also dying tonight. You didn't just get into a fight on Halloween. You are dying. You're dying, lady. I don't care. Now get out of my house. I have things to do. People to see children to change diapers up. I don't think I can get everything done today. It's a lot. Maybe I'll have to get the child thing tomorrow. I don't know. But what I do know is you need to get off my freaking property. Oh my god. No way are you a trick-or-treater. You're like 20 years old. Malcolm, a teenager. Listen, Malcolm, I'm a teenager too. And Halloween? I haven't done that for years. All right. So I'm giving you crap, all right? Get off my front step. I need to go to the city. And then I need to renovate the home. And then I need to throw this party and kill everybody, especially that lady who swiped my painting and didn't pay for it. She? She's the first on my has to die list. Okay, I don't really know where to go. So I think we'll go to the fashion district. It might be there. It might be somewhere else. I ain't sure. But that's the first place I'm going. The lady who swept my painting is here. Uh, <laughs> for no. God. 
You are so dying. If only you knew. <laughs> okay, maybe it's here. Yet again, don't know. Um, order food. Damn it! Thirty six thirty. What if I can't find it? I'm screwed. I don't know where it is. Maybe it's here. I don't. I doubt it's in the high end place. I don't remember what that's called. I doubt it's there, because I think the only place there that sells things is like a cupcake vendor. Anyway, not not pot for fish nigiri. Now, puffer fish nigiri, are you here? Wow. This is just produce. Damn it! Okay, so I think I need to get it from the. Oh, there's a ghost. I got distracted. Uh, I think I need to get it from the Japanese food stand. So that means that I think I might have to buy one, hire a vendor. And then get it from that because I can't find it. I think we can, yeah, hire a vendor. Do it. Hire a vendor. Okay. Now we're just gonna wait here. Okay. Order food. Oh, Vision of Gary, we found it! Now we've wasted a bit of money having to hire that vendor, but I think it will be worth it for mass murder. Carmen, I just won two tickets to Sam Ice, you know, theaters. Build out show, want to go with me. Hell no, Caleb. You know, if you weren't a vampire, I'd probably kill you here too. Now, after I cook this meal, I have to make sure that we don't actually eat it ourselves, or else that will be really awkward. Uh, but I think I'll be fine. <laughs> ah, famous last words. I know, but I swear, this time, not a lie. Now, these people just made more garbage in my home. Okay, we're move that out there delete that mini fridge put our bed there and on this wall here we're gonna buy the cheapest fridge uh we can get it in black i guess a cheap ass counter uh sure and a stove and that's all we'll need also i kind of wanted to get a table. So move our child right there, and we will get a dining table for our guests to die at. Let's get ourselves this one, I guess, in black. And okay, there we go. Now that that's all set, we can get to mass murder. We also need to fix our roof <laughs> real quick. There we go. Now we can get to mass murder. Ugh, I've been waiting for mass murder this whole time. <laughs> I have a special outfit planned for this. I'm a witch. I'm a pretty witch. What happened to my eyes? Oh, she has acne. Okay, can we not have acne? Thank you. <laughs> I want to be pretty with my purple eyes. Yes, I made her a witch because I wanted her to blend in to... The witch community, so that they wouldn't question when we tried to make a move on them. Mm. So I'm going to serve some dinner. Some puffer fish nigiri. <laughs> uh, sushi made from the infamous puffer fish. Beware! Eating low quality puffer fish nigiri or eating it in a bad mood may cause a slight case of death. Perfect. Party sized. You stole my costume idea. Why are you flirting with her? You stole my costume idea. I mean, you definitely have to die. Let's get this thing over with. Come one, come all. Is this still... Oh, unlock that. Alexander Goth, you can have a trick. Because screw you. I feel like Carmen's kind of evil. Whoa. Spooky time shenanigans. Is, if there's anything more fun than sharing a joke with someone else, it's having fun at their expense. Exactly what I think you'd say, Carmen. Because <laughs> you are kind of evil. What are you eating? <gasps> you also stole my costume idea. Well, I'm pulling it off the best. I'm the prettiest. Yes, eat it. 
eat it. How do you like it? Is it good? Is it tasty? Is it delicious? I hope so. They both seem in a bit of a bad mood. Maybe. It's because they're eating disgusting food that will kill them. Don't tell anybody that, though. It won't kill you, I swear! Eat it up! It's delicious! <gasps> it's happening! It's happening! Oh my god, Jeffrey's dying! Oh my god, yes! She's dying! <laughs> the first casualty has come! <laughs> oh my gosh! This is amazing! Yes, but act, act sad, Carmen. Act so sad over this. <laughs> this is so sad. Such a sad, sad day, isn't it? Oh, so sad. This is a lot of crap. Thanks for the tombstone. Now, anybody else want a meal? Now eat the pufferfish nigiri. I swear, it will, nothing like what happened to Jeffrey will happen again. It was, he just choked on his food. It wasn't the meal itself. And death is here. Meaning, I think, I need to, I don't know what he's doing exactly. But I do want to talk to him before he disappears forever. <gasps> Sergio's dying. Good. <laughs> it's happening. The death is happening. Halloween was awful. Well, I think it was great. Besides all these annoying crying people, <laughs> it's been amazing. I think you guys need to just eat the grief away. Look, I just made pufferfish nigiri for you all. I hope you enjoy it. Maybe it'll help you get over this loss. Oh my god. Somebody else is dying? <laughs> Your friend is dying! And friend is dying! Everyone is dying! Yes! Except for this goddamn lady who keeps taking our money. You need to go next, all right? This party is not over until you die. Oh, she's dying! Yes! She's dead! Oh my gosh. Yes, her head does deserve to be in that cabinet. This is... This is amazing. This is the best day of my life. Just a few people died. Just a couple. But nobody important. Look what happened to my freaking toilet! <laughs> Don't even be angry about that. Enemies demise. The death of a loved one can be traumatic, but the death of an enemy brings nothing but happiness. Sims can laugh at a tombstone to feel at peace. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> this is all I wanted. Let's, let's just take care of our child for us. And those of you left... Those of you left can live because my greatest enemies are dead. And I don't care anymore. This as long as my greatest enemies are dead. And thank you, Grim. You've been very kind to us. We do need a sink, though, just to dispose of uh, the disaster that is this house. You all can leave now. Congratulations on surviving the murder party! Goodbye! Good goodbye! Oh, thank you! See you later! Compliment outfit? I think it's very dashing. These sexy voice you have there, Grim. Oh, The boast about family? Uh... Joke about boogers? <laughs> I don't know how old we are, but you know, he might like that. Now, 
I think. Uh, Hello, darkness, my old chum. Have a sim befriend the Grim Reaper. Don't leave! No, Grim! Don't leave! Please! No! This is tragic. I had fun. I I really did. But this child is driving me absolutely insane. So I think I'll age it up. You know what? That's that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna age Bella up. And then after aging Bella up, I will uh, make her over. And then I think we'll end this episode. So let's do it, Carmen. Age your daughter up. Just turn into two of her. Lilith has sent Bella a gift. Aw, thanks, Lilith. <gasps> How cute. Okay, one, two, three. Clingy. Bella's clingy. Well, that kind of fits. She has... She's a complete vampire child. She has those ears and everything. But she's so cute. I love her so much. Okay, I'm... I'll, I'm gonna head into cast, make her over, and then I'll show you guys that and end this part. All right. Okay, so this here is Bella, and she is so precious. I absolutely love her. So I went with like a red black thing, because she's a vampire, and she aged up with like silver eyes, which I kind of just stuck with. And then I gave her like these cute little fangs. <laughs> I just think that she's just so precious, and I absolutely love her. So, I, I never ended up getting to Carmen having, getting pregnant with a witch child, but I, I will, I will. I think n next part, that will definitely happen, but right now, we, it was a bit chaotic, as you probably know, but I'm so happy with Bella, and I will see you guys in the next episode. So like, comment, and subscribe so that I can have a job where I don't have to interact with people. All right, bye.